Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another technological video for Anton 26. What we got right here is a laptop made by Dell. The model is the Inspiron 1545. And the main issue right here, the main problem, is that the motherboard looks dead. It doesn't matter what we have tried, it doesn't matter what we have already done. It seems that it's completely dead. Like you can see right here, we have removed every part and every component from this laptop and we reach at the main issue and the main problem. So try to remember that for every identical problem and before uh, you throw your laptop at garbage or before you take it at any tech store to fix it, which is something that probably will cost you a lot, you should check only one thing, which is the BIOS battery, the CMOS battery. Like you can see, we have already removed the battery. And we're gonna make a test to see if the energy of the battery is okay or we have to replace it. Most of times the laptop seems to have a BIOS issue. So the only thing you should do is just remove the battery for a few seconds and that's all. In our case we have to remove every, every component to reach at the, the battery. In other laptop, it looks more easy because you remove the back plate, the backbone, and it's easy to reach at the CMOS or BIOS battery. What we have right here is a meter by Renata. It's a watch battery tester. And right here we can see different numbers from one until number four. In order to reach at the safe area, which is this green area, we have to test it correctly. In order to test it uh, correctly, we must choose the right number. It seems that it's a little bit empty. We're gonna try it at number three. It looks that it reached at the green area. But when you put it at number two, look what is gonna happen. Here we go. It seems that it looks okay. So that means that we don't have to replace it, it's not necessary. So it looks that the only problem, it seems that, is right here. You have to remove for a few seconds and that's all. So we have already cleaned it, we cleaned the fans, we clean everything. We're gonna replace the thermal paste right here. This looks enough. We're gonna put everything back together and we're gonna make the last test and finally we will be able to discover if this was that problem. So try to remember if there is no response at your computer at all that means is a BIOS stack. So you remove the battery for BIOS and CMOS, you wait for a few seconds, you put it back and you restart your machine. So let's put our components back in place.
Okay guys, here comes a big moment. We have put everything back together and now it's the time to see if we are correct. And we haven't put the battery yet. So here is the cable for our power supply. The last step is to put back the battery, the back covers and of course the keyboard that is missing right now. So let's plug in the power supply. And here is the moment of truth. Here is the start button. And yes. Yes, yes, yes. Finally we are correct. We are 100% correct. And our customer's laptop is once again back to life. That's amazing. That's it's truly amazing. So please try to remember that for every time that motherboard looks dead and nothing seems to respond, it means that the BIOS has stuck. So in order to fix it, you must do only one thing. Remove the battery from CMOS BIOS, put it back again and restart your machine. That's the solution. Wow, it's almost magical. Almost magical. So we will shut it down. We put everything back together and we're going to start it once again. Here is the keyboard. One key is missing from the customer. The final step is the front cover. And everything looks shining bright. And we are done. The big moment, the final step, like you can see me right here mirroring myself. We're gonna start it again to see if everything is okay. We have a light right here. Let's start it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely brilliant. Now it's checking the disk, we don't care about that. The fact is that we bring it back to life, so that was the solution. So ladies and gentlemen, that was our tech video for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe at my channel if you want to know more about uh, computer issues and how to repair any problem, share it with your friends that maybe uh, have a, a common problem like this with their motherboards. And see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.